Hey guys, so I am doing like my first like real vlog, like not truly ASMR, just a real vlog. And I am going to just be rambling. So hang out with me while you are cooking dinner, while you are putting your makeup on, whatever, all the things. Um, first of all, how cute is this? Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas. This is from uh, Sheen. Do you say Sheen or Sheen? Really confused on um, which one to say. I need to pause this. It's Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. I need to catch up on it. I have two episodes that I need to catch up on. <clears throat> okay, so I am going to show you some jewelry, so show you some behind the scenes stuff, and yeah, let's go. So it's kind of a disaster right now. And honestly, you guys, I am a organized chaos kind of person. So for whatever reason, I really like working from my dining room table. It's crazy in here. And I really need to pick up and get organized. Look, I've got lipstick right here. But I just wanted to show you some stuff. This might be kind of tingly and ASMR-ish. Playing with the jewelry. This is so fun. This is a, um, I think it's a real shell. It's a ring. I have it on the wrong way, but I have just started my TikTok shop. Be listing that. I just listed these. These are vintage Sarah Coventry. They're gorgeous. Oh. And then these are mid-century modern. I have these listed too. I can't. These are just so good. They're beautiful. I don't know if my camera's gonna focus. There we go. These are not signed. They're unmarked. So I'm so frustrated. I have been on whatnot. And I have been to auction. And I have been buying things. And I... They are not approving me because my driver's license is not, I guess, up to their standards. And um, by the way, I do not know who these are by, but I just love them. I thought they were really fun and funky. I'm going to list those. Um, but yeah, Whatnot is just, this is vintage Sarah Coventry. There's her signature right there, Sarah Cove. Um, but what not just, I mean, and I'm on a loop where I will email them. Well, actually, they emailed me and said, listen, your, um, this is the little adapter for my phone to my microphone. But they email me and say, listen, you need to fix um, and work on the identity or your identity stuff. Your ID stuff so we can verify you so I'll click the link and it takes me why does this keep showing up everywhere <laughs> I'm recording um, I will work on it or I'll hit the link to try to work on it and don't you know that it will send me to a place that is pretty much like a broken link and so I'll email them and say, the link's not working. Can you help me um, get validated or whatever? Nothing. Nothing. So I just get like a automated response. Look at these clip-ons. I cannot handle these. I think they are so pretty. They're like tortoise shell where they kind of remind me of my table, which is burled wood. Kind of look, you know. 
all of this stuff is either listed on my TikTok shop or I'm going to list it on my website or TikTok shop or it's up there. This is beautiful. This is a real Italian. Let's see, Italy. Beautiful rosary. So pretty. Um, and I love this too. This is gorgeous. This green enamel. Oh, so pretty. I do want to, um, which the chain but that's the original chain thinking of putting it on something gold I actually had it on a necklace and when I was live on TikTok the woman that wanted the necklace said I'll take it but she did not want the crucifix have I showed you guys my my card so when you purchase something from me you get lots of secret information on the back let me get my phone number. <laughs> um, isn't this so yummy? So I wore this mesh choker, and it's the one everybody has been wanting. <laughs> and I could have sold it like a million times over, and I should have. Nobody knew it was for sale on my neck, so it is still available. And then this, these strands are new pearls, aren't they beautiful? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And I wore this before. I'm gonna sell this, I think. See, I have a new show in um, February for Valentine's Day, and I'm just not sure what I'm gonna put in the show. And my display is still at um, Bindings Art Gallery. I go and pick that up on Saturday. This is a ring sizer. I think it's called a mandrel. Ma man mandrel. Mandrel? Mandrel. I don't know why that sounds weird, but it's great. Junk. <laughs> This is my, I've shown you all this before, I know, but it's in bloom right now and I just want to capture it. Isn't it so pretty? It is called a, I, I know it can't be right. The lady that gave it to Brandon called it a um, Thanksgiving plant, but I really think it's um, a very spiritual plant because it always blooms around Christmas and Easter. She's so pretty. She's been pretty easy to take care of. Pretty easy. I got some poinsettias. These were two for three. I need to water these babies. Two for three. So I got four um, for some of Joanne's teachers. These were at Lowe's. That's special. <sighs> Look at all this. That I need to work on and clean up. going on over here, trying to learn how to stamp, and it's a very mathematical situation. I've got this bag of felt, felt bags. They're small though, but I do clean those up and put jewelry in them. tinsel on the tree. It just, it wasn't, there wasn't enough. And if you do something like tinsel, I feel like you need to do it. You need to commit to it. It's a commitment and you need to do it. And look, there's Tootsie Roll. Tootsie Roll is riding for an elephant. We don't know how it got there. 
Um, and then over here. So I know I've shown this somewhere, probably in my VIP group, but I bought this frame for $3 right here. It is beautiful. I mean, beautiful. Now, it did not have, do you see my hands going through it to the other frame? It didn't have a back to it, but you can buy stuff like this if it's really beautiful, and you can do all kinds of stuff. I just wanted it for layering, and it kind of looks like it's the frame for right there. It's just really fun. I know you can't really see Juju -Ju Baby, but I don't know. Okay, so I bought these from the Dollar Tree. And I was hoping that they would fit. Let me show you where I was hoping they were fit. They would fit. Okay, so I was hoping these would fit in these beautiful Ballard design. I know that does not look good. But just for something, just to see. And they totally don't. But I got that. And the other one's over there behind the tree. This was where the Christmas tree is, so I just moved it in here. But the other Ballard design, can you see through the ladies? It's kind of I don't think you can see it, but it's back there. Here's the top of it. Um, but I got that for five, the pair for five dollars, and they're like 55. So yep. I call that the trash tree because it's over there by the trash can. <laughs> Oh Lord, what is that? Look at Batman. So I got this for Julian. He was with us. And it's really cool. Batman Begins. Who is that? Oh, what is his name? Julian's very much into Batman. I was like, we've got to stop getting him stuff before Christmas or there's not going to be anything under the tree. Oh, sorry. Two fifty. Batman Legends. Oh wait, he put his his Batman sunglasses in here. Batman. Mom got him those. So anyway, super sweet. Mom always leaves her sunglasses over here every time. Every time she comes over here, she leaves her sunglasses. But yeah, so here's another little area. It's mostly trees. I did not get all of my stuff out this year. Just wanted to have it really, and this needs to be hanging. This is a mistletoe ball. I think it's supposed to be a mistletoe ball, but anyway, it's a cute little, cute little nook. gentle or fragile for June to be doing ASMR with it because you have to start losing all its berries and get bald spots but I really love that thing. I think it's so cute. This is some new stuff too. This is from my mom's basement. I am absolutely obsessed. Anything with a crust I'm into it. I am into it. And so it's Huge. I don't know if you can tell how big this thing is. And then I've got all these jars down here. And I, like, what do I do with the cords that are showing? I don't know. Um, is it this fun, this thing right here? It's a big old jug. Julian saw this and asked if I was um, in heaven there. <laughs> Really quick, I just want to show you. Boop. I don't care. And something is like true. I mean, it's like, it's like back there. Nobody can see it. When something is so good, sometimes you just need to let it be. I mean, that drum is huge. And normally I wouldn't want the seam to show like that. I would want that in the back. This is all original to this lamp. So, obsessed with that. And I've 
just been on like a resale hunt and but everything I find I want to keep like I paid a dollar or two for each of these and I would love to resell them um, I just love them look what I found we had our carpets cleaned and I've been looking for this hi Daisy and um, it was behind the couch This organized it was really a disaster and I really do love things when they have a place I really do Look, like that shouldn't be there but it's just been living there because that's with all my other brushes I don't know why I put my brushes up there <laughs> but yeah all right well I hope this was fun you guys little messy behind the scenes vlog real life need to get rid of my sweater and then I just started filling my jewelry boxes up with this stuff so or my this beautiful thing with my jewelry boxes so they were just kind of like right here but I'm gonna get organized and I so appreciate you guys supporting my jewelry my channel and my tiktok and all the things going to put this right on. I need some lipstick. Okay, I'll see y'all soon.